Hi, I'm David Gerard, and this is Pivot to AI, coming to you daily. Today, we're bringing fabulous gains to business with AI. Get AI into your company. Free efficiency. Intimidate your workers. Replace them with chatbots. The benefits are immeasurable, or at least they're not showing up in any measurements. The trouble with the huge gains for companies from AI is the gains don't seem to exist. McKinsey says in a recent report, quote, Nearly 8 in 10 companies report using Gen AI, yet just as many report no significant bottom line impact. Unquote. Over 80% of companies quote, report no material contribution to earnings. Unquote. From Generative AI. This stuff is costing companies money and it's not making money. Chatbots and co-pilots across a company, McKinsey uses co-pilot as a generic noun, which I'm sure Microsoft will be delighted by. They don't deliver gains that are actually measurable. For projects that use generative AI to do one specific job, 90% of these are stuck in pilot mode and they don't ever make it to production, mainly because they don't work. McKinsey blames large language models, which the chatbots are based on, being inaccurate and untrustworthy. This is, of course, inherent to the structure of large language models, because they're lying hallucination machines. A report from Asana in May says that 27% of companies they surveyed who bought into AI in 2024 now regret it in 2025. They think they jumped too early. McKinsey's answer to AI not working, is agentic AI, whatever that actually means, which will absolutely fix everything in the fabulous future, just not the present. But McKinsey can totally sell you some AI agents right now. The main thing protecting workers' jobs is that the AIs don't work. That doesn't stop the layoffs, because CEOs will consistently destroy their own businesses if something even offers the far-off future promise of firing all those workers. That's the product Microsoft and Google are selling the companies. Things will be better for workers in the medium term as the surviving companies realise that workers do things and AI doesn't. But in the short term, uh, it's going to be a bit on us. Thanks for tuning in to Pivot to AI. Please do hit like. Hit subscribe, leave a nice podcast review, and tell just one other person about this episode. We are mostly funded by the Patreon linked in the show notes below. So if you can drop just $5 into that, it'll help so much. As I record this, the Redbubble 25% off sale is running for just a few more hours. Get your clippy like t shirts and mugs while you can. Thank you all. See you tomorrow, and bye for now.